Good morning, happy Tuesday. I'm almost there. Gonna have to stand outside and wait and I'm fine with that. I've got my hat, got my gloves and I got my coffee. People stand in line to get into the store. <laughs> I think this thing is so adorable, but not like enough price. So Rob and I live um, in a housing addition that has over 7,000 people in it. So this is our beach area that was our tennis court the pool is coming up and as you can see the water is starting to or the ice is starting to melt and then we have um, the lake um, it's the golf course um, like the lake house where you can have dinner and then we also have a grill um, that we used to frequent but we don't anymore because of uh, life's little trials but other than that um, this is a great a great community to live in let me swing you over here and we live on and there are four if I'm not mistaken I think four um, lakes that all feed into each other so this is a huge huge lake so I wanted to show you what I got at the um, my favorite secondhand store, but I needed to come home, put my feet up. Um, update, I have lost 27 pounds in 15 days. All water, I still have a little bit to go, three, three pounds, and then I'm down to what I was before. But look, got jeans on. First time in seven weeks. All right, let's stay on track, Deb. Let me show you what I bought. I didn't get this at um, the secondhand store. I got this off Facebook Marketplace. Paid five dollars for it. is a It's a vintage little plant um, holder. It is adorable. So I bought these two candlesticks. I was possibly going to leave them black, but as I started pulling this off, <laughs> oh dear. So I might use. Um, some strip stuff on it or paint them white. I'm not sure, but I paid $3.50 each. They are wood with a felt bottom, so they're really good quality. And then here is my favorite. I paid $7.50. It's not an old scale, but I have big plans for this guy. Um, I'm going to buy a rust kit and make it even more rusty around the edges. To make it look way more vintage so 750 can't go wrong i don't think so before i show you what i'm going to use on the top of my cupboards i gotta confess something i gotta show you it's a mess don't think i'm the only one but let me show you All right, so who has one of those? Who has one that needs organized? We don't take all that medicine, I promise. A lot of that medicine is old. And then through everything that I've been through, I was given so much extra medicine that I, part of it I didn't even take. So that's what I'm doing. I'm giving myself 30 minutes and I'm done. Thirty minutes and it's all done. I am so happy that I can open it up and we can find what we're supposed to be taking instead of digging through every day. 
so dumb. But I did call Walgreens. They, in April here, um, have a drop-off medicine um, day, but with COVID, they're not sure. So they did say that I could take all of my old medicines to the police station, which I will be doing. I took off all the labels, put them together. I'll be burning those and then discarding the old medicines. Yay!